exploring context-aware user interfaces for smartphone, smartwatch, cross-device interaction. In this work, we present a context-aware user interface system on a cross-device interaction between a smartphone and a smartwatch, Synchro. We investigated suitable UIs for each context by examining available UIs and prioritizing them under each context. By using two devices, more contexts can be recognized than only using one device. Synchro provides the user with suitable UIs for contexts. It synthesizes layouts, feedback, or input methods of these devices according to the context recognized using these devices. In our research, context consists of the method of gripping the smartphone, the user's arm posture, and the user's activity. We defined 24 contexts to provide suitable UIs in various everyday scenarios. Among these contexts, A through J can occur while walking. Contexts K through N can only occur while resting in the seated position. Our context recognizer recognizes contexts based on machine learning algorithms using the built-in accelerometers of a smartphone and a smartwatch. The context recognizer runs on the smartphone and uses J48, SVM, RF, and MLP. This is a demonstration of the context recognizer. It can recognize the user's contexts in real time. In this demonstration, the user changes contexts from A to J. Recognition latency occurs due to the use of FFT and calculation of the recognition result. In I and J, the user puts a smartphone in his pocket. We conducted a long interval experiment to examine the level of accuracy of our recognizer in 24 contexts. We collected the data twice. The first round was followed by the second approximately five months later. These are the results of our experiment. They show the recognition accuracies of first round, second round, and long interval using SVM in per user and general classifiers. We examined the amount of training data required to stabilize the recognition accuracy. This result suggests that eight participants' data are sufficient to train our recognizer. In addition, we analyzed the accuracy of using either a smartphone's or smartwatch's data. The results show that more context can be recognized using both devices than only using one device. Therefore, using each device's data is important for context awareness. We show several applications to demonstrate context-aware UI systems consisting of a smartphone and a smartwatch. Firstly, we implemented a map application. In context F, the user can use the wide screen of the smartphone to browse the map and select a destination with his thumb on the smartphone. In context E, it is difficult to zoom in and out using one hand. Therefore, the user can zoom in and out using a wrist tilt gesture of the left arm while pushing the button on the smartphone. In addition, the user can send a part of the map to the smartwatch's screen by pressing a button. In context J, the smartwatch displays the distance and direction to the destination with an arrow, 
allowing the user to view navigation information easily while walking. Notification Management System In A, D, and E, this system displays notifications on the smartphone without any vibration when the user operates the smartphone. Similarly, in B, G, J, and M, it displays notifications on the smartwatch without any vibration when the user operates the smartwatch. In C and H, the system displays notifications on the smartphone and vibrates it when the user does not operate the device but holds it. In F, I, K, L, N, and A dash through J dash, the system displays notifications on the smartwatch when the user does not hold the smartphone. We also propose multitasking music player and video chat applications that automatically change UIs to suit the context. Thank you.